I'm Warmaster. Um, this is my first video tutorial, and I'm going to tell you how to make a game in Blender. I'm planning to do it over mostly two videos. Uh, I mean, I'm going to be going quite fast, so just pause the video if you think I am. Uh, let's get started. Uh, my part is going to be about with Kirby because it's easy and demonstrates all the basic principles. Right, first just press space add cube. And you go to this button here. And go over to modifiers and modifiers. Press mirror, do clipping. And then that'll Yeah. Press B to click and drag select. This changes what you're selecting. I like various season mode. Middle mouse button click to 3D rotate. Or one. Um, pull this down. I'm working on a laptop so click this and then the button is front view. 3 is side, 7 is top, and 5 puts in its perspective. Right, 1. Go down to modifiers again. Subsurf. That'll do it. Then change this to this. Delete, I just pressed there. Faces. So that it connects properly in the middle. Then go right here. A. A select all. Or unselect. B to box select again. Over here. Set my point number over here by clicking left click. Add cube. Press S to size down. Press S again. The middle mouse button click to restrain the axis. Then shift D to duplicate. Hit 3. Shift D, straight to the axis. And there we have Kirby. Mm. Yeah. Go to Apply, Subsurf. A minute. We have to be in Object Mode. Get the texture as well. Apply, Subsurf. That's not on the top. Then go back into edit mode by either pressing tab or just this. Now we want to mark seams to tell it where to stick the texture map. So right click these vertices, press Ctrl E, then go to mark seam. Same with these, oops. Marked. Basically now. That's yep, that's right. Right click on this little bar uh, and click split screen. Uh, UV image editor. Then go to face. Click A to select all. A on selects again. And go over into this one, control E again, unwrap, then A to shrink it down just a little bit. Then here's what's over here as a texture map thing. So we go to a new image, Kirby's pink, save ourselves some time. So then, I like this bit, texture paint. Let's just paint directly onto it and then it refers to over here as well. So click that little button so you can draw. I'm gonna try and boost the size up. Press C in here to bring up your options so you can have everything. Yeah. 
there's his feet um, Roy's eyes one to go to front on the eyes. Cheeks. Really crappy mouth but you get the picture. Well that's terrible with it. Yeah that'll do. We can change that to texture mode. Yeah it really is ugly. Um next bones object mode, make sure you're in object mode uh, press spacebar in the 3D window add armature I uh, put that in the wrong place we should just shove it in the middle of Kirby press Z to change to like wireframe mesh a couple of times then go back to edit mode for the bones we need to name the bones this is called body we go here add bone click a line to drag and then goes into grab mode um, name this hand dot L very important you do the dot L otherwise it just doesn't work it doesn't like it bone foot dot L then we go to this side we press and three Select, right click and shift D to duplicate. Control M, mirror, local axis. Right, there we go, we need to rename these. So if we take this out, put dot R so it tells it's right side. Let me go back to object mode. Oh no, sorry. Pose mode. Then go. No, we don't. Object mode. Then click the mesh. And then click your bones. And then control P. Armature. Name groups. Then we go into. Yeah, pose mode. And then click anywhere in the mesh. Then go to weight paint. No, wait a minute. So you can see what you're doing, you go over here, X-ray, white paint, there we go, that's a bit better. Oh, I might have forgotten something here. Um, you make sure that your mirror modifier is applied, otherwise it'll only do one side of the mesh when you're rigging it. Right, so white paint. Add, turn the PC right up. Okay, so I'm going to stop that video there and the next one starts with weight painting.